All right, g'day everyone. Um, basically today I wanted to show you something that I find pretty handy um, and it's built into Windows. So if you have like Windows 11 and I'm pretty sure Windows 10 had it too, but if you have Windows 11, which is the current one, most people have it, you can actually use voice to text straight on Windows. All you need is a microphone. So if you've got a laptop, typically they'll have a microphone built in or if you have a webcam, that'll have a microphone built in. All you need to do is press the Windows key and the letter H. Now that's going to bring up this Microsoft Speech Services. So you can see here, um, voice typing turns voice into text with Microsoft's online speech services. So if I click this, start that, and I'll click in here. And now basically what it's going to do is just transcribe everything I say into text. I'll give it a sec just to catch up. We can do cool stuff like say, full stop, new line, new line. And we could also add quotation marks. Well, that didn't work the way I thought it would. Um, but we can add a lot of other stuff anyway. Um, like I think if I go open bracket, close bracket, And there it does that. Um, but yeah, it's pretty easy. You do that. There's a little page here. I'll just stop it, which gives you some um, little handy hints on it. So here we go. Here's the little sort of things that you can say, how to use it and everything. So it's all in this little help article, which um, you should be able to find by like if you copy and paste that into Google, it'll come up or hopefully there's a link underneath this video to this um, article that gives you more information. So, you know, like gives you more stuff here. So let's say dollar sign. So we'll do it again, Windows H. Let that load up. Oh, cool. So if I go full stop, new line, new line, percent sign, dollar sign, asterisk, comma, new line, full stop, new line, and you can see there, it just does it. And then if you want to stop it, you stop it. If you want to start it, press it again. There's also the settings for it. So you can add in automatic punctuation uh, and let you do some stuff while typing as well. But yeah, that's basically it. It's pretty easy, pretty simple. A lot of people are like paying for voice to speech software, which uh, voice to text software, I mean, which in some cases, it's worth it. So like um, there's products like Dragon Dictation and stuff, which offer more features. But to be honest, like if you just want to be able to type out something reasonably quick, the way that you're saying it, this is a pretty good option and you've probably already got access to it on your computer.